Now, there's a lot of evidence about Jesus' resurrection, his claims, the historicity of the Bible, and so on, that you can use in terms of, of launching off to put your faith in Christ. You got a solid evidential basis. Now we're talking about the circumstances of life and the biblical position there. When you're walking day by day, you're doing this by faith, right, right. not by sight. And the world says, if I can see it, then I can believe it. Totally. But the fact is, is the, the spiritual man says, I'll believe God's word whether I can see it or not. And in fact, even the evidence looks to be the contrary to exactly. me, I'll believe it. Yeah. Talk about that a little you know, bit. Uh, faith is confident assurance of things hoped for with the conviction of things not yet seen. I trust something I cannot see. And that's what he has asked of us. That's what he esteemed Thomas. You know, blessed are those who see and believe, but much more those who believe without seeing. And the life of faith is counter-cultural. It's counter-sociology. But what, what's my option? To trust in my own machinations, my own systems, my own props, the medical community, one more set of medications? It doesn't do what they hope it will do. So do I trust, does Johnny, does Ken, does Cindy, do we trust in Christ and Christ alone in that? And that's the place of comfort, even when the pain is so loud.